Hi, welcome back. My name is Katrina McGalligit. Can I ask you to please subscribe and hit the notification bell so you're notified of any of my upcoming videos and if you give this video a thumbs up, that'd be great. I know I've been a bit quiet on YouTube since I did the videos of my Christmas presents. Just, I've been a bit down. Um, I won't go into too many details, just to say I've been a bit disappointed about something. And you know, it's really knocked me for six. But I'll bounce back, I'm sure. So hopefully things will be resolved because it's really knocked my fate in people. And that's all I'm going to say about it. So anyway, this is a video going into more detail of the Christmas presents from my son. You know, the Yesterday Lord and the Elizabeth Arden sets. So first of all, it's the set from Estee Lauder, it's the lipsticks. I know I showed you them in the video, but I didn't actually show shades or anything because I was quite constrained for time because the dinner was just about ready. So a set of five lipsticks. Get them all out. And I'm just going to have to get over my OCD about swatching stuff because I'm going to be using this. So I'm going to swatch and show you the shades. And uh, take me watch off. Just feels a bit tight on my arm. So that's one of the lipsticks. I'm sorry if it's a bit, there's some shine on them. This is the four shade and it's Kernel. And it's this beautiful, like, red. There you go. <laughs> but they're made to be used, aren't they? And this is in the shade Powerful. one above there isn't it beautiful I'll, I'll go sideways on the next lot I made a mistake but it's too late now just keep going and this is in the shade insolent plum the third one on the top there I'm just trying to do a little line so I don't I like. I want to keep the point on the lipstick, if you know what I mean, especially for the Cupid's bone stuff. I hate when I've used the lipstick and it wears down, and it's very hard then to get it exactly on the the edges, if you understand. So this is an insatiable ivory, lovely pinky nude. Next time I'll go. I'll go out a bit further. And then this one is the shade Emotional. Oh, isn't that beautiful? Oh, there's the five shades and they're all lovely and wearable. Beautiful shades. So that's those five lipsticks. Whoops a daisy. And then we'll go on to this set. Isn't it beautiful? I'll just wipe these shades off now. Yeah, I'm time to dry. So I hate this out. Isn't it beautiful, the case? Like, the attention to detail is just beautiful on it. Upside down. Oops, baby. I've been dying to use them, but I was very good. I didn't touch them because I wanted to show use first. So, do you know what? Is there a little card? Oh, I'll probably use the box for reference. Okay, yeah. 
Because there's no leaflets. So the first item we have is an Estee Lauder Revitalizing Supreme Global Anti-Aging Cell Power Cream. And I think this is only like... Um, does it even say? No, it doesn't give the size. Oh, it's five mils. So, um, everything is in French, German, Russian, and it doesn't give you any information just to say Advanced Night Repair Eye Supercharged Complex. So that's five mils. We'll do the skincare first, and then we have the little Advanced Night Repair Eye Cream. Oh, so there must be two eye creams one for day and one for night. That's unusual. And this is the one I've been most excited to use, the Advanced Night Repair Serum. For all skin types to use, apply on clean skin before your moisturiser. And this is 30 mils. I think this is quite expensive if I remember rightly. And then we'll, the swatches of the lipsticks. We'll do them now. I forgot about the other, other item of skincare. Which is the Estee Lauder Gentle Eye Makeup Remover. And this is 100 mils. I'll tell you. It takes a couple of goes of, mis of the micellar water to get that uh, lipstick off, which is quite good. I can't wait to start using these now. the job getting them out of the plastic anybody done any new year's resolutions well I have one I'm not going to be biting my nails anymore hopefully I've decided to try it and stop because you know sometimes when you bite down too too far and it does be sore well that's what happened to me and it hurts them when you're opening anything so this is intense nude from and they I should have said oh yeah the design of them the other ones were like a deck of cards these are like the backgammon uh, board game as I said this was intense nude not beautiful and this is pure Persuasive. Hope they're better swatches than the last time. And this one is Rebellious Rose. And this is the one I'm most looking forward to using. Oh, that's beautiful. That's, it's that one there. Isn't it beautiful? I'm quite proud of them swatches, as you know, I never, I never swatch on videos, but I'm going to be using these straight away, so I'm not wasting them. I'm not going to leave them lying, so I've swatched them. So then, the first eyeshadow palette is an Estee Lauder nude one. Isn't that beautiful? I assume that's a little blusher there. I uh, Estee Lauder Pure Colour Envy Eye and Cheek Palette. So the blush is called All Over Shimmer. Right, we'll just wash this off. 
Oh wow, there's some pigment in them lipsticks. It's taken three or four goes of the micella water to get it off. Make sure my hand is dry. And this is the blush. Oh, that is really, really light. I don't know whether you'll be able to see it. Where did I put it again? There. But it's more of a shimmer. I don't think I'd use that as a blush. I think I'd use that more as a highlight. It's there, but it's very faint. You can't see it in that light. So that's one eyeshadow palette. And the next one is... Pure Colour Envy and this one is the Glam Palette. Oh yeah, and the blush is a bit darker in that. They're still very um, sheer. But there you go, that's three or four swatches. And it's beautiful. That shade is called um, some surprising sculpt and blush pink pink something like. Why did he make the writing so small? I can't read it, it does say pink soap and that's the shade of it in any way. And then lastly we have the mascara. Oh, sorry about that, the mascara. And that's Lash Multiplying Volume Mascara. And then the same kind of backgammon board and this is discreet nude so this is a lip gloss I don't think you'll be able to see it out there it's very oh it smells lovely though and look at the size of the case and they're beautiful so let's put these all back in and then I will show you the other set. Make sure I haven't forgotten anything. again so now I'll show you the Elizabeth Arden set so excuse me for a second uh, the phone is ringing sorry about that no sorry I don't mean to be peering into the camera just I wanted to check it was back recording so sorry, apologies for the close up. So this is the Elizabeth Arden one. And I know I said this before, but I'm definitely using this in handbag. Oh, I love my handbag. And you know what? Next month I'm going, because I've been a bit naughty, in the January sales, I've done an order with Too Faced and an order with Tarte. And I have Look Fantastic and Birchbox coming. So it'll have to be next month now. There is a subscription service for handbags. So I'm going to be signing up for that. I think it's $29. I think it's $10 shipping to the UK and Ireland. It's called Baranzo, I think it's called. And they send you, you can do a choice. You can do a handbag and accessories, a handbag accessories and makeup, etc. I think it's an extra tenner for the makeup and stuff. So I'm going to start that next month. Oh, I love that bag. I really do. 
reminds me of a beautiful bag, lipsy bag I had years ago. Uh, the bowling ball shape. Beautiful, love that. So we open her up and we have three beautiful brushes. And does it look at that one? Isn't that beautiful? So I'd use that as a powder brush. I'd use that under my eyes. And then we have two eyeshadow brushes. A blender one and an angled one as well. There's two of those. Any information on the box? Tell you what type of brushes they are. Ah, oh, should not matter. Put it this way. So the three beautiful brushes. Can't wait to use them. Oh, I love me brushes, brush sets. Well, many more does the girl need. I have about six of them upstairs. <laughs> then we have this beautiful mascara. I'm so sorry, this neuropathy gets me down sometimes. I can't feel the tops of my fingers. Do you know how many mugs and bowls and plates I've smashed? I should have a held warning on me coming into the kitchen. So this is called the Grand Entrance Mascara. And then we have a beautiful eyeliner in smoky black. Now I'm not gonna swatch that because I have a couple of them on the go at the moment. I'm sure there's something else. Well, I could have sworn there was um, an eye line, uh, a lip liner in it. Maybe I'm imagining it. Let's have a look. No, there is a lip pencil, but I can't see it. Did I misplace it? Just let me have a look, see if it fell on the floor. Yeah, it had rolled under the floor, under the table, I should say. So this is a nude lipstick liner. There you go. I gotta remember, go lengthways with the swatches. So when we have the lipsticks, and this is in the shade Nude. Isn't that beautiful? Now I'm going to swatch these as well. That's the Nude. Oh, there's a beautiful scent off these lipsticks. And then we have Iced Grape. I'm getting quite proud of my swatches. Ice grape. And then, oh, there's four lipsticks in this. Wow. So I have Red Door, which is this one. That one there, isn't it beautiful? And then we have Pink Poker. Oh, I love my pinks, I really do. So this one here, let's have a look. Oh, this, that last one there, isn't it beautiful? That's a really pinky nude, it's beautiful. And then we have a couple of palettes. But first of all, I'll show you the highlighter. This is in the shade Rose Quartz. Oh, will I swatch it? I want to swatch it. It's so beautiful. I don't want to ruin it, but here we go. We're going to swatch. Be brave, Katrina. Be brave. Um, oh, it's very... Oh, it's a beautiful... See if you can see that. It's on the top there. You probably... See, the camera's not going to do it justice, but I think you can kind of see the glimmer. Let me just go over it one more time and see if we can see it. 
Oh, you can see it's a beautiful gold sparkly shimmer. Well, anyway, um, that's one. And then we have the two eyeshadow palettes. Isn't the packaging beautiful on this? This is, uh, I think this is the day one. Isn't that beautiful? I have a lovely black and um you might can't really see it but there's a beautiful sparkle to the eye shadows. I'm not gonna swatch these uh because I'm not going to be using them yet. I want to use up a couple of palettes before I get around to these ones. But um that's one. Oh, the packaging is just beautiful. And I love there's a blush in it as well. Now, I think this is my favourite one. They're all quite neutral, aren't they? But they're beautiful. And there really is a beautiful shimmer in a, a, a glittery uh, speckle effect on the shimmery shades. I'll get my words out properly. But these are the things I'm most excited to try. The Advanced Ceramide Capsules Daily Youth Restoring Serum. So, uh, see insert for complete instructions. Keep stored in a closed container. Cool, blah, blah, blah. Do we have... I didn't come with a booklet, so... Oh, wait. I think it did. The only thing it came with is little cards to show you different looks. So you have a day look, which would use the rose and mystic violet, bourbon rose, blah, 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 the different shades. So there's a day, night, day, night, day look, a night look, and that one's in French. So that's all, but I'm excited to try those and the little ice, the little capsules for the ice, ice serum, isn't it brilliant? Now, I'm no expert, but if I remember rightly, these are very expensive, but you break them open and you pat it on your skin. Break these open and pat them under your eye. As far as I can see, there's only about 12 in that, I think. But yeah, there you go. There's all the sets that I got for Christmas. And listen, thank you very much for watching and take care.